Now the thing of this is, is I want to buy one of your bridges, but I don't have a lot of money to spend. So each of these sticks is going to represent one million dollars. So every time you have a bridge, it's a million dollars. And so we have to think about our bridge not only as able to hold up a cup, but to make it in a way that we can actually afford it. This year we've been really focused on building their mindset, working towards having a growth mindset in class. And it's the idea of that you don't walk in with a fixed ability, that you can, through hard work and through struggle, you can grow as a learner and as a person. So we've been doing lots of activities where the first time they run through it, they find a lot of problems and difficulties, but through using the strategies that we work through, through growth mindset, they've been able to work through it and find success. This seems like a challenging activity, right? Mm -hmm. So we know we're gonna have some difficulties, so we're gonna use our growth mindset tools when things don't go well right away, we're not going to learn them. We're not going to look at them as failures. We're going to look at them as just a way that didn't work. And we're going to look at it as a way that we can build off of and move on. We all know that challenges are going to come up in our life. And I guess um, my personal belief is, is how you look at that challenge is a big uh, deal of how you're going to actually be successful or not be successful. So for me, um, teaching the kids that life is going to be hard and there's going to be things that are going to come up that are going to be challenging and to not look at those challenges as something as a negative but as a learning possibility is, is important. So what we want to do is I want you to come up with a plan on how we can eliminate some of the money. Maybe try and take off the weight slowly. That would hurt. Okay. And, and you might want to think about what is this, what's the, what are the places that you want to do that. I would talk. I would talk with each other before we start pulling it. For me, I just look at it as um, when I was in school, um, I, I remember thinking that um, some students were smart and other students weren't, and that's kind of just how things were. I remember feeling that way, and I remember struggling in school and, and maybe not having like a, a set of tools where I felt like I could rely on, like, no, if we keep working at this, it's going to be okay. Um, so I wanted to really help students that felt that if school was hard, that it's okay, they're learning while they're struggling, and it's just a process. I wanted them to think more about school as a process, rather than just either you get it or you don't. Growth mindset is like, you can like never give up on like anything that you would do. So like if I were like, to like try to, if this one time class tried to step at the same time, if we were just to give up, we would have fixed mindset. Now if we were supposed to give up, then we would have growth mindset. It's not something that I see um, immediate feedback. It's more like down the road when you see them working on something and you hear them, you hear them say things like, um, I know that this is hard, but if I can work through this, I know that I'll get it. Or you can see them staying with activities that are harder, longer or you can see them being excited to try something that's more difficult, where in the past they may have taken a route that they knew they were gonna be successful in right away, um, but with learning that they grow when things are harder, that I can see them wanting more challenges. You never give up never when give things up. are hard, you just like stick with it. Like yeah. It's been, it's been really fun to see the students uh, strive towards challenges. And it's kind of brought our class closer together. It has brought our class closer, closer together because when we have a challenge, I, can, I hear other students saying things like, you can do it, stick with it. And that's been, it's been really fun.